Here's why going no contact works, even on your avoidant X. So a lot of people ask, hey, does going no contact work on an avoidant too? And people ask this because they're wondering like, man, like this person just cut me loose. Seems like they really didn't care. You know, will this work on them too? It's like, yeah, they're human. When people go away from each other, they miss each other. That is a force of nature, right? Just as soon as I grab or I drop this phone, it's going to fall to the ground because of gravity. And the way attraction works is that it grows in between the space of two people. Now, when you think back to when you met this person in, um, uh, initially, okay, you were there was never a greater time of mystery between you two people. You didn't know each other. So there was space in between you two, right? And when you first got together, there was a lot of excitement. It's probably never a better time or, or never a time of greater attraction between you two than when you first met. And so it illustrates the point that even with your avoidant ex, okay, they are still subject to the laws of attraction. And so as you're in no contact and as you're not contacting them or liking their posts or watching their stories or wishing happy birthday or any of this stuff, they are going to start to miss you. Your avoidant ex is still human. You see what happens with avoidance is that they get into a relationship and then that person, they, you know, they've known each other for long enough for that person to finally start to communicate their needs, okay, and holding that other person accountable, you know, to it. And when the stress of having to deal with their own problems and the feelings of their partner comes into play in conjunction with other life events, grandma dies, work is stressful, whatever, they would rather cut the relationship loose than to stay into the relationship and fix it. Now, yeah, it's going to depend upon how insistent this person is at avoiding stress, right? How self-aware are they? Do they know they're avoiding? Are they in therapy? You know, these things will affect, you know, how quickly no contact will work on them in terms of them coming back. But no contact is so effective, a lot of people don't even realize the times when their ex comes back because they mess it up. You know, if, if an ex comes back around, you know, because of no contact, somebody comes in and uh, they kind of mess it up over text and they go away again. They're like, oh, well, it didn't work. It's like, well, yeah, it brought them back to you, but you have to know what to do with it from there because your ex might choose to breadcrumb you when they come back or they might choose to put out some feelers to see, you know, where you're at. So it, it's not necessarily going to look like, oh, no contact. And then, bam, you're back together. But it does work on avoidance as well. Now, right here, you can see a message from somebody I got last night um, who reattracted his ex through no contact and then used my texting method to kind of hook them back in. And he's super excited about that. You can read here in the message. So if you want some help getting this kind of thing together, click on my profile and then click this link. And once you get into my store, you can choose an option to work with me. I'd love to listen to your situation and give you some advice moving forward.